Hey, what's up guys? We got another update for y'all. So, uh, actually a few things. First and foremost is we are now number one. We have the highest amount of Google reviews in our area. Um, we're only leading by two, maybe three after today, but, uh, but we got there. Uh, it only took us a year and a half, so that's pretty exciting. The other companies that, the other company that we're head of has been in it for, you know, 15 plus years, so that's a big feather in our hat that helps us out a lot uh, I've mentioned it several times before in these videos that you know having those reviews definitely puts you in a position to uh, have residual income because whenever they're out there looking for those top rated companies it looks really good for you to be at the top of the list um, especially if you're newer and you don't have quite as much volume as the, the better established companies um, it, it puts you in a position where those companies are getting called and they're, you know, a month or so out and then you're only a few days out. So, you know, you guys can stay busy from that. So very excited to be in that number one position uh, for Google reviews. And then the other thing is we got our largest quote year to date, our largest commercial job year to date. Um, this one job is more than my entire revenue last year when I first started my pressure washing business. So this will be my first uh, five digit pressure washing job. So I'm very excited about it. Uh, I will be partnering with one of the local guys here. Um, I've already called them. They're gonna go out there and they're gonna sub it with me. So excited to get that rolling. And then in preparation of that, the other cool thing is in preparation for this job, um, I wanted to go ahead and kind of increase our efficiency a little bit better. So I went ahead and got us a gas roof pump. And this weekend, uh, it's pretty neat. All I did was uh, reached out to him. And now this weekend, I'm gonna get to meet up with Leon Johns. Uh, if you guys know anything about gas roof pumps and Leon Johns, you guys know that he's like the uh, poster child for gas roof pumps um he knows what he's talking about when it comes to these things so uh, i feel very fortunate that it just worked out and that's and that's the incredible thing about having your own business and, and kind of acting on faith is that things just happen when they're supposed to happen so uh i've got this job coming up i needed a i needed a gas roof pump called around couldn't find them anywhere uh the night that I told my wife, I was like, okay, well, we got to get one. I'll find one. I don't know how I'm going to find it, but I'm going to find me a gas roof pump. Somebody had just posted one for sale six minutes prior to, you know, me getting online. Called the guy up. He was in South Carolina. Went and picked that up uh, two days ago. And then I called Leon uh, the same day. Asked him if there was any chance possible that he might be, you know, somewhere local where I'm at or... Uh, that I could meet up with him and get everything plumbed up. I was actually gonna drive to LaGrange this weekend and try to meet him and try to get everything plumbed up, but it just happens that he's gonna be at Fernandina, which is only like 45 minutes away from me. So he's actually gonna be on vacation down here. Uh, so the timing was just perfect, but he's gonna be down here in my area. So I get to hop down there either Saturday or Sunday and uh, meet up with him and bring the pump and he's gonna help me get everything set up get everything plumbed up i'm gonna get one of his uh two-way manifolds if you guys haven't seen his manifolds he makes incredible manifolds for these gas roof pumps that's always been kind of the achilles heel for them is people thought you couldn't uh blend them they thought you couldn't set up a, a manifold with them and people always batch mix with gas roof pumps but leon's uh, invented a manifold that you can use for mixing your bleach and your soaps and uh, your water and everything for different strengths um, for the gas roof pump. So uh, he's going to be bringing one of those and it actually has uh, the one I'll be getting not only will it allow me to mix different surfactants and different uh, strengths of bleach but it's going to have the, uh, the remote too. So that's going to be a huge plus. It's going to save me a lot of time running back and forth to the trailer. I'll just be able to take the remote, hit the little button, and switch it from leach back to water go from cleaning or go from uh soaping to rinsing just like that so that's going to be 
uh, a huge time saver, a huge improvement in efficiency. So I'm super excited about that. Um, and that's, I mean, that's, that's it. That's kind of where I'm at right now. Uh, the business is, is going very well. Um, I will say calls have slowed down a bit, but again, a lot of that I think is due to uh, neglect on my part. I haven't been posting as much about the business. I haven't really been uh, pushing it as much as I was before, but a lot of that's just because I've been so busy that I just, I haven't had time to get on there and post stuff. Uh, I'm still a one man operation right now. It's been trivial here lately doing that. Uh, been a lot of fatigue. I've been staying extremely busy. Um, Ten and fifteen thousand dollar a month uh, in sales. It, that's a lot of work on one individual. So it's been very stressful. Uh, fatigue wise, it's been very stressful. So I am getting set up now to start looking at hiring like legit hiring I know I made the, the video before about how I'd hired an employee all that kind of fell through uh, you know they, they weren't able to stick around they uh, they ended up having to move but um, I'm I'm trying to get away from having helpers and actually trying to get positioned to a place where I now have employees oh um, because I feel like that's that was the original plan that I had uh, for the business and I tried to shy away from it a little bit but it hasn't panned out for me so I think I need to just go back to that you know I feel like that's the best uh, the best uh, direction for the company so uh, I am gonna do that and then I also ordered some uniforms from thin print I ordered them about three three and a half weeks ago so uh, any week now I should be getting those so I'm very excited um, they are a little bit more expensive um, actually a good bit more expensive but from the reviews and from the people that I know that have them they're much more leech resistant so you know even though you pay four times the amount for one shirt that shirt should last you a lot longer than uh, most of the other shirts that you know you would get on a regular basis so but that's it. That's the last update I got for you guys right now. Um, you know, as always, do me a favor, like, subscribe, hit that bell icon so you get notifications when I upload new videos. And I'm going to keep you all posted when I get started on that big project. So, and uh, might I might throw out some numbers. We'll, we'll see. But if you guys are interested, you can always just hit me up on, on YouTube or hit me up on Facebook. And, uh, you know, I'll try to uh, help you guys out and let y'all know, you know, anything you've got questions about. So, but very excited about this weekend uh, to get that gas roof pump all plumbed up and, uh, you know, just kind of to kind of get to meet Leon. So, but that's it. That's all I got for you guys. As always, I'll see y'all later.